Hello everyone, here is Four Sun Soil Company. I am Tracy. Welcome to watch our Canton Fair on Nitrate Soil. Uh, today I will show you our SUS series modified sideways in water. Let's go here, please. Uh, this is our SUS series modified sideways inverter with AC charge function and it has two uh, working modes you can see from this picture and one working mode is the solar charge mode and when work at the solar charge mode it can charge the battery uh, by the solar panel and another working mode is the inverter working mode and it can convert the DC voltage of battery to AC voltage and then supply to the AC appliance. And this series inverter has two models. Uh, one model is uh, SUS500A. The P power is 500 VA, it built in 10 amp PWM solar charge controller. And you can see the data here. Another model is the SUS 1000A model. The P power is 1000 VA, it built in 20 amp PWM solar charge controller. Uh, here is the 3-inch LCD display. You can check the working data here, uh, such as the battery voltage, output, uh, output power, and the battery charge capacity. And let's see another side of the product. Uh, these are the terminals for connecting the battery. This black color one is is the positive pole, the black color one is negative pole. And here are the fans for cooling the inner side and it will turn on and turn off according to the uh, radiator's temperature. And for example, uh, when the inner temperature over 14 degree, the fan will turn on automatically. And if the inner temperature come down to 14 degrees, uh, the fan will turn on. Uh, this is the intelligent fan. Uh, it is very helpful to uh, reduce the power loss and also can extend the service life of the fan. Mm. These are the terminals for connecting to the solar panel. Uh, here are the uh, terminals for connecting to the DC, uh, DC loads. And you can connect the DC load here and use it directly. Uh, let's see another side of the product. Mm. Uh, here are the uh, AC socket, and it connect the AC load here. And uh, if you press this button, this AC socket will have AC voltage output. And here are the L. LED display, LED working light. If the red LED lighting, it means the inverter will at protection statue. If the green LED light, it means the inverter works well. And here are the USB port. Output 5 volt and 1 amp. And it is convenient for charge the battery. Uh, oh, it is convenient for charge the mobile phone and other uh, AC and other DC loads. And the key point is this series inverter have five protection uh, function to protect the in inverter not easy to damage, and uh, overload. Uh, over over low voltage and high voltage and higher temperature and over low and the um, reverse per relative protection. 
an each immortal um, pack in one color box. Each box includes uh, one immortal and two piece cable. Cable. Um, one piece black cable. One piece is uh, black cable. And please pay attention. Uh, there has two uh, loop here, and the small loop. You can see the small one loop is connect the uh, connect to the uh, connect to the inverter terminal, and another big big loop is connect to the uh, battery. Uh, also have one warranty card. Uh, one you are below and the uh, following time I will show you how to use this inverter um, the first time the first phase I will show you the uh, inverter working mode First of all, we connect the inverter. As I told you just now, mm, the red cable is to the red terminal. The black cable is to the black terminal. Uh, please make sure uh, don't make mistake. After connect the inverter, uh, we connect the cable to the battery. Ensure the AC loads. And can you see The DC load uh, insert to the USB port. Press the button. And you can see uh, the inverter is work work well now. Uh, the AC low and the DC low are uh, also working well. And you can check the working data here. Uh, here is the battery voltage. This is the output power. And the last time I will show you uh, another working mode, uh, the solar charge working mode. And this inverter, uh, we suggest you to use the solar panel. The input voltage is uh, 15 volt to 21 volt. The power is 100 wattage to 115 wattage. You can see the uh, data sheet here of the solar panel. Uh, the VMP voltage is here. This is the power. Uh, this 
specification is uh, OK for this inverter. And we connect it first. This, this inverter uh, is suitable for the DA's uh, battery. Uh, uh, battery voltage is 12 watt. Um, does not support the lithium battery. And the battery capacity will suggest 100 AH to 115 AH. And after you connect the uh, solar panel, and you can check, um, check from the LCD display. If there is a, a charge logo, it means the inverter is, is charged normally. And that is OK. And, and this, is, this is all for this SUS series inverter. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Thank you. Bye bye.